Greetings everyone and welcome to my video. Soon tax season will be upon us and I'm going to show you how you can find the right statements for your tax report from Binance.com. Now there are a lot of exchanges out there but I'm going to show it on Binance because I prefer to use Binance and if you don't already have an account on Binance use my referral link below and you will save 20% for a lifetime on fees. Now let's get started. So with Binance there are two ways to get your reports. One is via a spreadsheet in Excel or Google spreadsheet or you can do it via API. I'm going to show you both. So what, what you have to do is go to wallet and select overview. You can select transaction history here on the left. Here you can select generate all statements. Here you can select the range, the accounts, and what type of coins you want. Select generate. Binance will then send you an email when your report is ready. Then you can select download here. I've already done that. And here is my report. What I have to do is go to data up here. I can select either from text or from CSV. So I'm going to do that from text, select that document, select get data. Here it says that I need some type of indication to separate the columns, because as you can see here, all the information will be in one column. I select next, I select comma, because that's what Binance used. You can see here, then it gets separated. I select finish new page and OK. And it's that easy from Binance generate report. Insert the CSV file into Google spreadsheet or Windows or Microsoft Excel. Sorry. Now there's another way to do it, too, that I prefer. Go on your account, select API management. Here you can create an API, create a tax report API. Here you will need to confirm your email and authenticator code. W what you will have to do is on the restrictions, make sure that the API can only read data and don't trade or withdraw cryptocurrency, just read. Your tax report program or website should have a guide on how to set it up, but it's basically here. I use one that's active all the time that can easily check my data. In Norway, we use something called Crypto Second. And yes, that's basically it. It's actually that easy to get information for your tax report from Binance. So I hope this video was helpful. If you have any questions, feel free to leave them below and I will get back to you. Thank you.